On Friday, the Prince and Princess of Wales paid their condolences at the Aberfan Memorial Garden to those who sadly died in the Aberfan catastrophe. On October 21, 1966, a coal tip avalanche killed 144 people, including 116 children. William and Kate were brought through the Aberfan Memorial Garden to remember people who perished when a colliery spoil tip collapsed, dumping tons of ash slurry onto the hamlet below. The garden is located on the site of the former Pantglass Primary School, which was destroyed by a landslide at 9.13 a.m. On October 21, 1966, just before classes began, the late Queen Elizabeth II and the late Duke of Edinburgh paid their respects at the community on October 29, 1966, and Her Late Majesty established the Aberfan Memorial Garden in 1974. Please like and subscribe to the channel. Her failure to visit sooner was regarded to be one of her greatest regrets throughout her reign. Despite this, mourners flocked to see her, and the link she formed with individuals she spoke with during that visit on October 29, 1966, lasted the rest of her life. Aberfan survivor David Davies, a former child at Pantglass Primary School, and Professor Peter Vaughan, Lord Lieutenant of Mid Glamorgan, led them around the memorial garden. They visited trustees from the Aberfan Memorial Trust, who are in charge of maintaining the garden, as well as members of the Aberfan Wives Organization, who lost family in the catastrophe. The royal couple is visiting the community near Mirtha Tidbill in South Wales for the first time. Friday was the Prince and Princess of Wales's second day of engagements in the South Wales Valleys and Mid Wales. The duo joined the Central Beacons Mountain Rescue Team on Thursday and tried their hand at abseiling. Thank you for watching and subscribe to the channel.